Well, my sister Rosanna was one of the first people who came out and spoke out about about Weinstein and uh, the Me Too movement. I think has had you know global impact really from nuns coming forward to people in Parliament to people in Japan, you know, talking about things that people had never talked about before. As far as Hollywood and the impact on Hollywood, I do see an impact. I I feel like. People are much more cautious and people know that they have to treat people like human beings to a certain extent or they're probably not going to end up working. I mean, there's been a sea change, hasn't there? Women won't take it anymore. It's as, as simple as that. In, not in my world, because my world is I'm sitting alone in a room writing songs. And either somebody loves the song and wants to do it or they don't. So I don't deal with a lot of that. And I haven't dealt with a lot of it in my life. And all honesty, because I'm not working at a company, you know. So I haven't, I mean, I had my own little teeny moments of weirdness <laughs> with guys. But, you know, nothing that was like what some of these women have gone through, which is terrible. So, But it's changing. What's your name? I have the blessing of working in the Ryan Murphy hemisphere, so he has always been there. You know, I walked into a space where he was already doing that kind of outreach and, you know, sort of being present for the issues and the complications in our industry. So, you know, lots of women, lots of trans people, lots of different kinds, of, lots of people of color, you know, sort of already exist in that world with him. You know, so I feel like I've been spoiled. Yes, I have seen a change. Yes, I have seen a change. I have. I think people have become more conscious about the way in which they treat women. And I think that people um, are now understanding that there are appropriate and inappropriate ways to behave and to, to treat us. Uh, and hopefully it keeps changing and that we now learn that there are boundaries uh, and that we aren't to be abused for simply working and doing our jobs.